my name is Carmela if you are new to my YouTube channel and I am sorry I haven't posted videos for so long it's literally been two months since I posted a YouTube video and this is partially because I haven't had time to make it and I've been super busy with schooling and doing my homework and everything I've had a lot of homework this one I've been actually looking over my YouTube videos and the two that mainly stood out to me was my reptile videos, my care videos and how I breed my, my worms to feed my reptiles and all that stuff really stood out to me because I was like probably like 12 in those videos. Those are old videos. And I just wanted to do an update on my pets and my reptiles because a lot has changed. So let's get right into the video. Don't forget to subscribe. So the first reptiles that I'm going to be going over are the ones that are in my room. Okay, so in this tank we have Atlas, and that's the bearded dragon that you saw in my previous video. Uh, I think it was called Reptile Reptile Surprise or something like that. It was a baby bearded dragon. He, he, he is a Hybro Net Trends bearded dragon, and I got him when he was like that big. He was probably three months old and he is in this enclosure so this is atlas he has changed a lot he is definitely way bigger than he was before and he is about a year old now and he is my precious little baby i like to call him chunky monkey because his belly is really big <laughs> he spends most of his time on his basking spot and he loves it up there and he also loves eating his salads if you're wondering why Atlas's head is white, I don't know if you can tell, but Atlas's head is white, and the reason it's white right now is because bearded dragons shed in patches, so they don't shed their whole entire body. Like, we shed our skin, it comes off a little at a time. He sheds in patches, so hit his head will shed and then his arms and then his belly and his tail that is why his head is white so when a bearded dragon goes to shed his uh the color of their skin will turn dull so you see the rest of his body is orange but his head is white so you know he's gonna molt so that's why he's very tame i've always held him like when i watch tv and stuff he'll always sit on my lap and he'll just chill there i can like put him on the table and walk away and he'll still be there that's how tame he is but he is a little lazy the tank next to atlas i have pandora's enclosure she's my female bearded dragon she was probably around three or four months old and we got her at the reptile convention i don't know what breed of bearded dragon she is the breeder that I got her from at the convention never told me, so I'll probably find that out later down the road. When she gets old enough, I'll breed her with Atlas, and then I'll get little baby bearded dragons. So, we just gotta see how Atlas does with that. Right, baby? He doesn't talk. If you guys would like to see me do a care video about my bearded dragons, please leave me a like down below and I will be sure to look into that for you guys. I am pretty knowledgeable already about bearded dragons, but if you have any questions or concerns, leave them in the comments down below and I'll think about it. This is a bearded dragon that we have and she's a rescue. Her name is Sunshine and she's new to our family so I don't really have any footage of her but um this is this was a temporary setup we don't have her in this substrate anymore but we're looking forward to rehabilitating her and giving her a better life i might consider making a youtube video about her because it's really cool to see how a journey from an animal that has been abused to up and running and healthy again and i really hope that it inspires others maybe i'll even make a video about her journey and her story. One that I probably won't mention in most of my YouTube videos is my beta fish. His name is Neptune. I have previously made a YouTube video about him also when I first got him. I'll try to make more YouTube videos about him, but then again, I don't know. So that's Neptune. I probably had him for a year also. And just a fun fact for you guys, I'll probably put this in my care guide. how you know you guys that's it for this video if you liked it please leave a comment down below what your favorite part of this video was i had a lot of fun making this video i'll see you guys next time have a wonderful day bye